You are watching part 7 of the video series on Java 11. Java 11 maintains strong backward compatibility with previous versions, especially Java 8, ensuring that most existing Java applications can run on Java 11 without modification. Here are some key aspects of backward compatibility in Java 11, along with examples. Source compatibility. Java 11 maintains source compatibility with Java 8, meaning that Java 8 source code can be compiled and run on Java 11 without changes. Binary compatibility. Java 11 maintains binary compatibility with Java 8, allowing Java 8 compiled bytecode that is the class files to be executed on a Java 11 runtime without recompilation. If you have a Java 8 compiled jar file containing classes compiled from source code like the example above, you can run it on a Java 11 runtime without recompiling the jar file. Standard Library Compatibility Java 11 maintains compatibility with the Java 8 standard library, ensuring that applications using Java 8 standard library classes and methods continue to work on Java 11. For example, Code that uses Java 8 standard library classes like java.util.arraylist or java.time. Local date time will work the same way on Java 11 without any changes. JVM and runtime compatibility. Java 11 maintains compatibility with Java 8 in terms of the Java virtual machine, JVM, and runtime behavior, ensuring that applications written for Java 8 behave similarly on Java 11. For example, Applications that rely on specific JVM behaviors or runtime features in Java 8 will continue to work as expected on Java 11. Third-party library compatibility. Java 11 strives to maintain compatibility with third-party libraries and frameworks that were built for Java 8, ensuring that applications using these libraries can be migrated to Java 11 without issues. For example, Libraries like Apache Commons or Google Guava that were built for Java 8 should work on Java 11 without requiring updates. While Java 11 maintains strong backward compatibility with Java 8, it's always a good practice to test your applications thoroughly when migrating to a new Java version to ensure that they behave as expected and to take advantage of any new features or performance improvements offered by the newer version. Hope this was helpful for you. Please check out our playlist for more videos. And also like and subscribe our channel for more such informative content. Good luck!